Nate Chambers for the Professional Riders Organization. I'm here at the Bromont three-day event on Sunday at the conclusion of the CCI Three Star with uh, our first and second place riders. Uh, we've got John Halling here and Boyd Martin. Uh, John came in first and Boyd came in second. Uh, we're just going to talk to them a little bit about, uh, about their weekends and how it all wrapped up. Um, Boyd, why don't we start with you? Um, so after the uh, dressage uh, and cross country, where were you sitting? Uh, Nate, I was in a, uh, I, was, I think I was in fourth place, but it was a tight, like, I think um, Johnny was out in front a bit, and then we had uh, three or four of us within a point of it, so I knew it was going to be a close finish. So, fifth after the cross country, what about the dressage? Where did you place in the dressage? Uh, he's, me, I don't know, I think he's about fifth, he did, a, he did a good test, he's a green horse, he's uh, just got the ride on him thanks to a syndicate that's banded together, and um, you know, I think we saw in the CCI class this weekend a, a group of very, very young three-star horses all of a sudden step up and uh, I think it's pretty exciting when you look through the top six that there's a, a very, very exciting group of young horses, uh, eight, seven, eight, nine year olds coming through, which is great for the, the sport and the future here. Well, it's amazing the toll the show jumping took today. I mean, the you know top five riders, even the top ten, there were a lot of experienced riders like both of you there. I mean, you know, Philip was in, in second place going into the show jumping, and you know it still caused a little bit of issue. And so it just goes to show what the bit of experience you you have and you know, the amount of horses you get to ride all came together to help you move up into the slot. Absolutely, but uh, I think the weekend belonged to this guy here. He, uh, he had a disappointing. Uh, miss out on the Pan American Games and it was sweet justice for John this weekend to get in there and, uh, and blitz us all. Well, I, I love the story of John with this horse. As we talked about earlier in the weekend, John's had this horse since he's two years old. It's owned by his mother. This is really his baby that he brought along and it's really a family affair. Uh, John, how, how excited are you about the win today? I couldn't be more happy. Um, it's a fabulous horse. It's, you know, like I said before, it's always fun when you have one that you pick out as a young horse and you hope it's going to turn out to be what you think um, and it's everything that I hope you would be in order. Now in the show jumping, you, you, all, you gave us all a bit of a heart pump. You had two rails in hand and, and you used them, but you rode like a demon out there. You rode great and, and you kept your cool through to the end and, and it was quite impressive. Yeah, you know, he's a fabulous horse, but he was, you know, this is his first big test. Um, this is his he, first three star, First right? three star and he was definitely tired today. So we had two rails before uh, at fence five. By the time we got to fence five, I had two down. And fortunately, my good friend Jeff Morgan had announced when I went into the ring that uh, I had 11 points. So as I was cantering <laughs> from fence five to six, I had visions of Boyd in my head. And I, was, I was counting on my fingers, and I counted to three, and I realized that I couldn't have one more. And so I really, I was excited that two of the next three fences were oxers, which that was typically not really well. And so I really rode him up hard to those, and he jumped better and better as he went. And I'm really proud of him. You know, obviously you'd like to have a clear round today, but the fact that he struggled early on and got better as he went says a lot about what kind of quality he is. Well, now you're a seasoned rider and you've been around a good while, but I believe this is your first three-star win, is it not your first CCI? My three first star? CCI three-star win, and uh, it was a big, a big goal coming into this weekend to be as competitive as I could have I realized. Um, that I was going to have a chance to win it. And you looked at those guys who were sort of on my neck with Boyd and Phillip, and, and a lot of those guys staring me down. It was, it was plenty enough pressure, so I was happy to get it. Well, you're a wonderful rider to watch, so it's great to see you finally get a bit of the recognition you deserve. Uh, both guys rode great today, and the competition overall was wonderful. Great weather, great footing, and uh, it really showed the true test of horse and rider. I'm Nate Chambers for the Professional Riders Organization at the Bromont three-day event with John Holling and Boyd Martin in the CCI 3 Star Division. Thanks so much, and we'll see you all soon.